Hello everyone, now we will see the concept of Euclidean algorithm. This algorithm is used to find the GCD of two positive integers and it is based on two facts. The first fact says the GCD of A and 0 will be A and the second fact states that the GCD of A comma B is equivalent to GCD of B comma R where R is the reminder of dividing A by B. So these are the two examples for both the fact I have taken. GCD of 10 comma 0 is 10 according to the fact 1. Next GCD of 36 comma 10 can be written as GCD of 10 comma 6. It is here I have written according to the fact 2. Since I can find still I can divide it. So I can write GCD of 10 comma 6 as GCD of 6 comma 4. Again I am using the fact 2. This process will continue unless I am getting the GCD of uh, 2 comma 0. This is in the form of fact 1. So according to the fact 1, whenever any uh, we are to, going to find the GCD of any positive integer and 0, it will be the positive integer. So I am writing GCD as 2. Now let us see the steps involved in Euclidean algorithm. So here the input is two positive integers a and b. The output is GCD. If we see the internal computation, first it will check whether the value of A is less than B. If it is, then it is going to exchange the positions of A and B and divide the value of A by B and get the remainder. If the remainder is 0, then B is reported as GCD of A and B. If the remainder is non-zero, then we are replacing A by B and B by R and return to the previous step. Okay, this process will continue until we are getting the reminder as 0. So, if we see the uh, Euclidean algorithm in the form of process, R1 will be the value of A, R2 is the value of B and R is the reminder. After computing, R2 will become R1 and R will become R2. Okay, and this process is repeating until we are getting the reminder as 0. As soon as the value of reminder is 0, R2 will become R1 and R2 will become 0. So, according to fact 1, the GCD of R1, 0 will be R1. So, I have written R1 here. If we see the algorithm of Euclidean algorithm, uh, sorry, the example, this is the example what I have taken. Already I have solved it. The, we need to find here the GCD of 20 and 97 by using Euclidean algorithm. Here, Remember the value of A is R1 and value of B is R2. So according to the steps, according to the algorithm, if the value of A is less than B, we should exchange the value of A and B. Since 20 is less than 97, we are going to exchange it. So I am writing 97 and 20. After that, divide this 97 by 20. 20 fours are 80 and reminder is 17. After that, the value of R2 is shifted here and value of R is shifted to R2. Now 20 is not less than 17, so divide it, 17 ones are 17, reminder is 3. Again, R2 will become R1 and R become R2. Then 3 fives are 15, reminder will be 2. This process is repeated until and unless we are getting the reminder as 0. So finally, we can write the GCD of uh, 20 and 97 will be 1 because the value of R1 is 1 now. Okay, thank you.